that's a bit underwhelming. Hi guys, Manny from Ride Off Rescue here. Thanks for joining us again on the channel. Today we're going to be doing part two of the Skoda video. So we're going to be finishing the car off. Now that's going to entail replacing the front guard. So we're going to be taking the one off this donor car behind me, the blue one. Uh, we're going to be also giving the car a really good wash, taking it for a test drive. And also we've got some new alloy wheels to put on the car. So without further ado, let's get into it. Oh, looks like we finally got there. Looks like they got a big blob of adhesive on there. So there we go, guys. Guards off. Time to get it ready for paint. We'll just send it off to our local paint shop, get it painted up white to match the other car, and we'll get it mounted up onto the other Skoda. Wow guys, what a difference. Look how shiny and clean it is. It looks almost new. There is still a few little marks here and there and that they'll need a bit of a polish to get out, but look at it. It's about a thousand times better than it was before. Even those dirty wheels came up quite nice. Okay guys, it's the moment of truth. Will she drive? here we go so far so good feels all right no vibrations I'm sure she hasn't been driven for quite a while so I'm sure she'll be happy to get out stretch her legs how's the alignment wheel alignments off but that's to be expected when you do such major suspension work so That'll be easy enough to fix. We'll just head down to the local tire shop and get them to do a quick wheel alignment and we should be back in business. Otherwise, she's driving well. Let's see if we kick it down into sports mode. There we go, a bit more lively now. Yeah, for a 1.4 litre, doesn't do too bad. It's got a little bit of pep. It's not gonna 
get you off the line in five seconds or less, but uh, it's enough to get around town. Yeah, I'm quite happy. It's going good. Temperature's looking okay. Hasn't even got up to temperature yet. Obviously, we checked all the oil and the coolant and everything like that. Everything was good. It's uh, still got at least a few months and about 9,000 kilometers until its service is due. Yeah, she's running well. I think that's enough for a test drive. Let's just head back to the shop and go from there. Okay guys, it's a new day. Uh, we've got the guard painted up now, so we're ready to start putting the Skoda back together. So let's get into it. Okay guys, so you can see we've got it on now. All the panel gaps are looking pretty good. It's all come up quite nice. Nice and even here where it meets the bonnet. Nice even door gap down the bottom. You probably saw in the time lapse that I did a little bit of panel beading on the lower sill here. I also put a little bit of touch up paint on it. I didn't notice it was so bad when we did the first assessment, but I think that's probably okay. They're usually pretty dirty, so once it gets a little bit of dirt on it, I don't think you'll even notice. You probably also saw we took all the wheel liner, the under trays, I think there's three different under trays under there off the uh, blue car, and we put them back onto this car, because when we took this one out, they were all broken from the accident, obviously there was a lot of scuffing and things underneath and they were all cracked and so on. Alright, so look, I think we're pretty much done with the car now. Alright guys, so the time's come, we're going to be putting on some new wheels now. I'll show you what they look like. Here they are. They're from the VRS model Skoda, so they're going to look a lot nicer than these standard low spec wheels that are on the car at the moment. So let's get them on the car.
that about wraps us up today, guys. Thanks for joining me. Now this project is finished, it's time for the car to find a new home. So if you like what you saw today, please consider subscribing, uh, give us a like, I'd really appreciate it, and we'll see you next time.